Greetings, dear Gemini. Thank you for joining me for the monthly channeled inspirational reading by Astrological Sign for all Sun, Moon, and Rising Sign Geminis for the month of March 2015. This is only a general reading, which may or may not specifically resonate with you. If you would like to order a personal reading so that I can tune in to your concerns, your situation, to assist you with gaining more clarity personally, please check out my website at www.naturallyhighlight.com. Thank you for listening. Now on to the reading. The very first card that we have is this one. And what is coming up is light. When I see this card, I see that you are truly breaking through. Someone has been having some types of fun with in their workplace. I see you having to really brace yourself in the past so that way you can maintain your composure. And I do see that there are some underhanded things that may be going on behind your back and you want things to come to the surface. You wanna be able to see what is real, what is true. I feel that you will gain some relief this month of March and that you should not worry at all because things are going to go and work in your favor when you do get this card. I do see that. Unless you happen to be the one with the underhanded things, then things may happen adversely on the other side, perhaps to you, and maybe other people are wanting to gain clarity in the situation that you're a part of. But keep your hands clear and clean. Keep your heart pure as well as you can but I do see negative influences are there in the mix and I don't really see that you are so much the ones that are listening to this are really the ones that are the culprit for things that are going on what it does show that things can be switched around and they can be changed but it is going to take a little bit of time in that time that that is going on when things are shifting you would definitely want to have some communications that are a bit more clearer. You want to be able to speak up and speak what is on your mind, but do it in a way that is calm and loving, and that can be achieved if you are really not feeling that. It can be achieved by listening to some types of classical music, some relaxing things, music. You can really will yourself to do this. That some people really need to just surround themselves with positive things so that way it can happen that way for them because whatever you focus on does expand I do feel some sorrow is there I do feel that there is some control in an environment and that two people are playing a dance going back and forth like a merry-go-round and one person is not seeing what the other person is saying and vice versa I see that you can tune in to how this person really wants things to open up. I see that you have more influence in the matter of your workplace, of your relationship, of your family members than you might know. I do see that you're changing your appearance. You're wanting to really express yourself better, but you want to also change yourself from the outside. So I see that you'll be undergoing some sort of a transformation from the outside. I do see that. But also, when I do see this, I do see that you have this in your favor. All right, continuing on. My neighbors were making some noise. I had to turn this off. So when you get this card, it is showing that, and this is one of my favorite cards, that in this situation that does seem as though things are hopeless things are not working out that has been happening for a while something that you've been experiencing or going through I see is more so of a mental thing but it does have to do with some communications that have happened and you don't like what was said and it's weighing heavy on your mind now But it does show that you will be able to get through this and it is going to assist you to be able to 
move forward but you gotta stop focusing on negative things and you gotta move negative influences away out of your space and if you are going to have them around because you can't control everything but your thoughts can be controlled and you can place more energy on certain thoughts and you can take that energy that you have that is so important and you can place it on the most important thoughts and energies that you want. If you look at this card, there is a little person here. So it is showing that you need to give love to yourself and not rely so much on the environment or the outside to do that. Now I know, and I, well I do sense that you have been looking at some things to help you along with moving forward and maybe you haven't been as successful as you'd like but I do see with this card there is you, you there is a glimpse of hope there there is something in you does want things to change and you do want to feel better you do want to see things expand some of you are going to experience things changing in a really broad way this month in such a very deep way and it's going to be so transformative for you and the other people in the environment. So let's see what the angels say about this. I do see you did get Archangel Michael's patience card. So it is showing that your patience is paying off. And if you will hang in there, if you will take your time and just set out to look at things more in a long-term manner, not looking at instant gratification, especially with your work, with what you want, and how you want things to come together. Just putting together small plans, taking steps and steps and steps. Large successes are not had overnight or in a day. They happen over time. They happen step by step. I'm not saying that you may not have something huge happen in one day, but the way that it's most likely going to happen and can happen and you will be less inclined to being sad is if you will just get ready and take the small steps now to get ready all right thank you so very much for listening to this this is the very first recording of these monthly readings in the series i appreciate you thank you so much for listening and please like, subscribe, and share. Peace and much love.